Hi, my darlings. How are you? This is going to be for my Libras. And this is going to be for the weekend of the 19th and 20th of August. I will be using my Radiant Rider Weight Tarot deck. And to clarify, I'll be using my new Tarot Feminine Tarot. So let's see what messages we have for you, Libra. So Libra, this is for you. The Knight of Wands, some kind of passionate energy within you right now. The Page of Cups, you need to start using your intuition, darlings. The Seven of Cups, you have many choices. The Ace of Swords, mental clarity. The Knight of Swords, a shift in your environment. The Ace of Pentacles, ooh, some money coming in. The Queen of Wands, this could be a fire energy within your environment. This could be a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries. The Judgment card, you might have gone within and done some self-evaluation. And the Empress, abundance, or it could mean fertility. So, let's see. top of the nine of wands we have the six of wands we have the nine of wands and we have the death card the six of wands is about being successful the nine of wands is about you being resilient no matter how many times you've fallen down you've gotten back up and the death card is about change something is about to change in your environment something is ending doesn't mean death okay it just means the end of something the end of a cycle here we go. We got the Page of Pentacles. We got the Knight of Cups. And we have the Page of Cups. So the Page of Pentacles, you're working on something. You could be very goal-oriented and you might be manifesting some stuff. Um, the Knight of Cups, I would say something charming. Maybe something romantic coming in. And the Page of Cups, you need to use your intuition, my darling. Okay. You might be someone who loves being in love. So we got the Page of Pentacles, we got the Knight of Cups, and we have the Page of Cups. Then the Seven of Cups here, you got choices. Some choices. You got the Three of Cups, celebration. You got the Three of Wands, which is longing and preparing. You're preparing for something. Um, you're expanding something, maybe something to do with business. I'm not sure. There's going to be some kind of celebration and maybe you're starting to see things clearly. Or maybe there are some secrets that you don't know of as yet. I got the moon. I got the three of cups, the three of wands and the moon above your choices. Maybe you're not seeing these choices as yet. Or maybe you did. I don't know. The Ace of Swords, on top of the Ace of Swords, you got the Queen of Cups, you got the Knight of Swords, and you got the Star card. This could be an energy in your environment. This could be a Pisces, a Cancer, or a Scorpio, or maybe you're feeling a little emotional about something. I got the Knight of Swords here. There's some kind of shift going on, or you might be impatient. You might have a little impatience about something, but I got the Star card. So you need to keep, keep the faith. 
Okay, keep your eye on the prize. It's coming. Don't give up. Don't you give up. I got the Queen of Cups, the Knight of Swords, and the Star. Star card above the Ace of Swords. Don't give up, all right? Might be getting a little impatient. Then you got the nice Knight of Swords here again. But don't you give up. Don't you be get impatient. I got the Queen of Pentacles. This could be an Earth energy, or maybe you're thinking about another business plan here. Maybe you know how to handle the money. So the Queen of Pentacles, this is a Virgo, a Taurus, or a Capricorn within your environment. You got the King of Wands here. This could be a energy also in your environment. This could be a Fire energy. This could be a Leo, a Sagittarius, or an Aries. And then we got the Page of Wands. Well, you got some fresh ideas and you got a lot of energy and you're fearless. You know, and you're going after whatever it is that you're desiring. So there is going to be a shift. You got the Queen of Pentacles. You got the King of Wands. And you got the Page of Wands here. Then you got the Ace of Pentacles. Financial new beginnings. Maybe a promotion. Maybe some more money came in. Something happened, but you need to take a break. You've been working very hard. I got the Four of Swords here. You need to rest. I got the Queen of Swords. I would say that is you, Libra. And I got the Ace of Swords. You're going to have mental clarity. There's going to be breakthrough and you're going to have some new ideas. The Four of Swords, the Queen of Swords, and the Ace of Swords. Now we have the Queen of Wands over here. <clears throat> On top of the Queen of Wands, we got the Nine of Pentacles. You start to see your rewards. You got the Five of Cups. You're a little emotional about something. You feel upside down emotionally. You feel some kind of grief for something of something. And the Six of Swords, you're moving on to, um, to calmer waters. Things will start calming down pretty soon in your environment. So you got the Nine of Pentacles, the Five of Cups, and the Six of Swords. Above the Queen of Wands. So maybe there's something emotional about that person. Um, but things may calm down with that energy, okay? The Judgment card, you've done some self-evaluation. You got the Eight of Cups, the Four of Wands, and the Chariot. You're thinking about walking away, but you're just thinking about it right now. You haven't really actually done it. The Four of Wands... Um, your home celebrating there might be reunions or something going on around you but you're still far away you might be physically there but you are far away and you got the chariot you're going to be very successful something is coming towards you really fast and whatever obstacles are ahead of you you will overcome them okay you got the eight of cups you got the four of wands and you got the chariot and then on top of the empress abundance you got the Eight of Swords, you got the Three of Pentacles, and you got the Sun card. So somewhere along this line here, you tied yourself up, okay? You made yourself your own prisoner. The Eight of Swords is you doing, you're doing, you're doing, okay? No one does this to you but you. And you allow this, okay? So you need to change the way you think about things. Stop worrying. Stop having that fear and anxiety, you know, and, and, and thinking about stuff over and over and over and over and over. And worry, 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 worry. It doesn't work, okay? It really doesn't work. Um, you got the Three of Pentacles. The universe is building something for you. Maybe some kind of um, shared goals with someone, collaboration with someone. And with that, we'll, it will bring you a lot of happiness and success. I got the Sun card. So even though you're a little tied up, I feel that you will come out of it. You have to believe that. Okay? The darkness always brings the light. Please always remember that. Whatever goes up must come down. Right? I love you guys. You take care of yourselves and I will chat with you soon.